guys I'm back and I'm happy that you are back as well here on my channel today I have some wonderful news for you Mary my darling friend you know her from several collabs that we have already done or she has organized I have organized now we have officially teamed up and we are hosting an Instagram page together it's YouTube collaboration and we will organize YouTube or and Instagram collaborations on that side where we can easily organize also more than 15 participants. So everybody is welcome. Either you want to do a YouTube collab or you want to do just on Instagram a photo or if you want to do both, go ahead, follow us. I will link it down below in the description box so you can see what's going on. The first one we have been doing is a hippie collaboration. And the second one is also already announced. It's the Valentine's collaboration for February. So go check that out and follow and let us know if you would like to join. We would be happy to have you all. So today the theme is hippie and a lot of ladies participated. The list is as usual down in the description below. You have all the links if they have a YouTube, if they have an Instagram, if they have both, everything's there. So go check out all the wonderful designs that we got. And thank you to everybody who participated. Let's have a look as usual at the gorgeous collage that Mary made for us all. And then we'll see what I did. And we had again some wonderful designs. You have seen the collage. Thanks to everybody that participated. It's always fun to see what everybody comes up with for one theme. I really enjoy this and it's always a pleasure doing this collab. For me, hippie, I thought about Austin Powers movies, <laughs> psychedelic stuff, peace, love, music, these things. And that's where I came up with, I have to do a water marble with some funky psychedelic colors. And here you can see that already my water marbles are already done. But of course I have filmed that. So I will show you how I did that. I'm quite pleased how they turned out. And I'm gonna put some water decals with a hippie theme on top of some of my fingers. I used so far, as usual, a base coat. I used Sally Hansen Complete Care 7 in 1. Then I used as a base for the water marble this Starily Magic Rainbow. I thought the colors would pop more if I use a holographic polish. I don't know if that worked or not. You could also use something in white. To avoid major cleanup, I use the Moyu London Cuticle Guard. I really like that. It dries very fast. It always goes off in one piece, so no problem with that. However, this one contains latex, so if you are allergic to latex, you cannot use that, of course. Then I have water marbled with four different Cirque colors. So I have this Rhapsody in blue, really nice, gorgeous royal blue. Then I have the Fire Island, bright orange. This is this electric daisy. This is this yellow with a hint of green. And then I have the plastic, which is a neon pink. These water marble, awesome. I am not a water marble witch, but I really like how they turned out. And especially that I got the colors on both hands quite similar. <laughs> this was something that's not that easy, but I managed to do that and I'm quite proud of myself yeah then I put on some fairy dust we all need more fairy dust in our life some sparkle which is of course also fitting for a hippie theme and then when I have put on my water decals I will put on the C&D Vinylox top coat to protect my design I used this dotting tool from Bundle Monster, very tiny dotting tool for my water marbles. I used some tweezers to remove cuticle barrier 
and I will also use the tweezers to place my water decals. I have a video where I explain how I did that. Essentially you need to have special paper that you can print on and then you can make your own water decals in case you don't have stickers or you don't have a stamping plate that contains the designs you want. And in case you're like me and you cannot do freehand at all, this is gonna save you so you can print out your own water decal. What else did I use? Yeah, I used here my clear jelly stamper pink cleanup brush, which worked really great. It's acetone resistant. It has a very, very small tip here, so you can easily go in and get everything removed. And that's it already. I'm gonna show you now how I did my water marble and I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna put on these water decals. And as usual, you know the drill. I'm gonna speed up the video, so sit back, relax and enjoy. And I see you afterwards with the finished design.
and I'm back. I have put on my decals and I think it turned out really cute. Look at my little bus down here and look at my little heart. Here the girl is a little hard to see but that's always the problem with transparent decals. Otherwise I think they turned out really really nice. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. Also, if you have any further questions or comments, I always enjoy reading all your comments and I will answer to everything. That was it for today. Please don't forget to check out the other ladies' videos. They will also be happy for a like and a comment. And if you haven't subscribed yet, up here is usually a link that you can click then you are immediately subscribed or down in the description box below. I would be happy because then I would see you in my next video again. Thank you so much for watching and I wish you a psychedelic time <laughs> wherever you are. Till next time. Ta-da!